But yes, this music is also very epic. You can open this door if you get a hundred orbs, and it's just like a five second extra scene. You can just search it on YouTube. It's not really that important. That's epic though, look at that. Oh. And here's the final boss. I can't remember what you do. <laughs> what do you do? Oh. First person mode. This part, you gotta rush. Or else there'll be an oh my god WTF explosion. But yet, the final battle takes place on the silos. That's pretty epic. It's Green Nico, let's touch it! No. <laughs> oh. Yeah, they should have used Red Eco for this part, because I don't think you use Red Eco in this battle. Which, once again, brings me to my point that Red Eco is easily the most useless Eco. And, where is. I should be getting infinite because I, I'm standing over it. And I barely. I'm probably gonna die, unfortunately. I can fly! No, no. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? Oh, Jeebus. Oh. So, yep, lots of platforming during this boss. There you go. What? What? No, 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 that is not fair. <laughs> I jumped and the bomb was still was still there. That is not fair. And now there's Dark Ego all below us, so you do not want to fall in there. Let's see if I can take this guy down in one shot. Oh, now he fires lasers at us. Gotta be careful for this fight. There you go. And here's the final part. Jeez, they're shooting multiple bombs. Oh god, what do I do? What do I do? Where'd he go? Super Saiyan! Kame. Kame. Ha! Wee. And dead. Let's just sit back and enjoy the ending. Sad face. <laughs> this is epic.
Imagine they fall off the platform. Ah! <laughs> well, it looks like I may have been too hard on you boys. You do have what it takes to be heroes. But Daxter, now we can't change you back. Don't worry about me, baby. You know what they say. Big things come in small packages. <laughs> Jack, you have an incredible talent for channeling Eco. Samos, you may have been right about this one after all. And Kira, without your help and ingenuity, he's none hitting of on her. Would have been possible. <laughs> Perhaps we've found another sage now that Gaul and Maya are lost. Yes, Gaul and Maya. The Dark Eco probably destroyed them. Uh, probably. Ah, who cares? Bring them on. We can take them again. Right, Jack? <laughs> I said, right, Jack? Uh huh. Wow! Put it on ice, big guy! Jack! You freaking. C word and like. CB. I don't want to say <laughs> Uh. But yes, that is Jack and Daxter, the precursor legacy. And uh, about what he was saying right there about how, uh. Call my they're probably dead. Uh, surprisingly, they uh, never came back. Unless they're in Lost Frontier, as far as I know, they're in, they never came back. They're dead. Which is a shame, because they were pretty cool, even though they're barely in the game at all. And also, uh... What? Oh. I was positive there's a way you can speed up the credits, like if you hold X or something. Oh, yes! Hold X and you can speed up the credits, because I don't care. No one cares about credits nowadays. And it's the claw music. Holy Yakko! What could that be? Wow! It's an ancient precursor door! It looks like it will only open if we fill all 100 holes with power cells! Oh, goody. Oh, boy! Here we go again! And yep, and now here's basically new game, well, you have to open that with 100 orbs, and basically what it does, what happens when you uh, get 100 orbs, it'll show this giant white light standing before the door, and what is in it is a precursor uh, a ring, precursor rift ring, and we'll find out about that in uh, Jack 2. Let's just quit. Yeah, I love that chime. <laughs> so anyways, uh this is uh I hope you enjoyed the LP. This is uh Turner4590, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for uh, Jack 2. I'll see you then.